If you want to save time on grinding your badges and get it maxed out real quick, make sure to hit up Wish Grinders for legit and fast grinding services. Link will be in the description. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. For this quick video, today we'll talk about Lightning Reflexes badge. So now let's get into it. Actually, I didn't even test it, this badge, this 2K21, because I believe it's exactly the same badge from 2K20, and I had lots of testing already for this one before. I even made 4 videos about this. I know there are some changes on some other badges, but that's only the value of boosts, especially for shooting badges, because shooting sliders were really changed. But in terms of badge functionality, everything should be the same. So with all those tests including things like lateral quickness, change of direction on sprint and laterals, and some other in-game experience, I concluded on that series that the badge does nothing, aside from giving you an earlier cue on that read and react system, which doesn't really work properly in the first place, which I covered on my first video, making the badge useless. And for those who don't know, that read and react system is not a made up term, it really exists on the controls, which is the yellow arrow that tells the direction your opponent is going, which doesn't really work properly. And after making those claims, I received lots of comments disagreeing with my conclusion. Then after some weeks, Mike Wang replied on a tweet saying that the badge only concerns the read and react system, nothing else, which justified my case. So that tweet is just a justification, I don't just rely on that. Now, <laughs> I know I know I know, you probably disagree with me because some players or even most players see a lot of things with this badge, like it takes away the delay, they rebound better, they play passing lanes better, and change directions better blocks better, and the list goes on. These are just some. But with all due respect to your findings, I believe these are just placebo effect. Just like for example, the moment you equip the badge and you see a good defensive sequence, you just put the credit on the badge saying that, oh, that must be lightning reflexes. But in reality, those things really happen, even without the badge. To be honest, I was even a victim of that placebo effect before. There was a time that I read a patch note saying that alley-oops were buffed. Then when I played, I started to see that my lobs were going in, more efficient. And I was like, oh yeah, my lobs are going in efficiently now. So that note was correct. <laughs> the next thing I know, that patch note was fake. So it happens sometimes. Now going back to the lightning reflexes, I think one reason as well is that the term reflexes leaves an impression that it will boost everything related to reflex. I even received comments saying that the badge must be really useful because they said that in the official roster, Elite defenders like Kawhi and PG has it, that it must be useful. Well, 2K made a system, that read and react system, and they made a badge to boost it. So of course, they need to put it on players. So of course, they will put it on players like Kawhi, for the sake of being realistic. But it doesn't mean that it really works, and you need to equip it. It's a failed experiment by 2K, probably that's the reason why the badge is gone for the next gen. Another thing about this one is, don't you ever wonder why players have lots of different opinions about this badge? Like literally a lot, like things that are really different to each other. I think that's one sign that something is wrong. I can't name any other badge with that kind of speculation. So again, badge is really useless and you need to take it off now, please. And if you have any other feedback, just leave it in the comment section so all of us can talk about it. So that's all for the video, if you like it, please smash that like button. And don't forget to drop by the channel for some other videos. And as always, stay safe, game responsibly, and happy gaming guys. Peace.